Hey guys, this tutorial is going to show you how I did a look inspired by one of my favorite true crime podcasts called Crime Junkies. If you haven't checked it out, you 100% should. For this look, I started with the eyes. I took my NYX Ultimate Bright Palette and I went into the inner corners of my eyes with the hot pink. From there, I went right into the middle of my eye with some purple from the same palette and just blended those two colors together. And then on the outer corners of my eyes, I used the dark blue from the same palette. I also used some dark blue from the Urban Decay Electric palette to get that really bright payoff. Once I had all three colors packed onto each eyelid, I went in with a fluffy brush to start blending those out and get a really smooth finish. I also popped some white eyeshadow into the inner corners of my eyes. Once I blended everything to how I wanted it to look, I took the same colors with a flat brush and brought those underneath my eye, right below my waterline. I used an NYX eye pencil in black to line my waterline. And here's where I went in with liquid liner. Don't mind me, I was trying to use the TikTok filter to get the perfect winged eyeliner. The filter did actually work pretty well. I got a really nice shape out of it. Now I moved on to my eyebrows. I used my own personal eyebrow hack. I use some washi tape and just kind of block out how I want my eyebrows to be shaped and then fill them in with powder. I also used my Control Freak Eyebrow Gel by NYX to hold my eyebrows in place and it also gives something for the powder to stick to.
I used my lash glue pen from Kiss and then applied some false lashes right on top. Using a fluffy brush, I started applying my NYX Glitter Primer. I put this all under my eyes and anywhere I wanted any glitter to stick to. And while that was still tacky, I just started using the same fluffy brush to go in and dab some of the glitter on. I used the same color glitters as the eyeshadows because that corresponds with the Crime Junkies logo, but you could use any color glitter you want. With my blue Mayron Paradise paint, I started painting my chest and shoulders. I then went in with my light purple and soon after my hot pink water-based paints all along my chest and I just blended all three colors together. So my camera did stop recording this part, but I did add the same color glitters that are on my chest, um, on my neck. I did the same technique as I did with under my eye. I just applied the glitter primer and then stuck the glitter anywhere I wanted it. I also went in with a fine brush and started creating these watercolor-esque splotch marks on my chest. Uh, I used the opposite color on each side just to give some kind of contrast. Here I am telling myself which way I need to paint the logo for it to show up in pictures correctly and then continuing to still paint it in the wrong direction. I did do an outline first in black eye pencil and then I went right in with my black water base paint and started painting out the C and J for Crime Junkies logo. And I used a fluffy brush to stipple and splatter some of that black around the edges of the logo. And I did add a little bit of white face paint to the black logo just to brighten it up a little bit and make it more visible. I did go in on my lips with an NYX liquid suede lipstick in Alien. I 
I threw on my black wig and that completed the look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please like and subscribe for more. And if you check out Crime Junkies, let them know I sent you.